On your MacBook, do you want this menu bar? Whenever you click on your picture, it will extend all the menu items in the menu bar. Then you click on the picture and it will close all the menu in the tray. And these items will also be customized. No matter you're using Adobe or Safari or any other software or a browser, these items will be customized as well. So it's kind of beautiful if you're recording tutorial. All you need to do is go to browser new tab and write bartender. Don't worry, it's not the bartender in a real bar. Just go to this click link and here you can download the bartender app and read the description as well. After downloading an installation, just go to your setting and first thing you need to do is to go to privacy and security. Here click on screen and system audio setting, then allow permissions to bartender app, then in general login items and extensions and allow permissions to bartender at login because if you don't allow bartender then the item will be disturbed again on restart. By the way, if you are unable to install, then just go to privacy and security all the way down and check this one always. Allow accessories to connect always and allow application from App Store and non developers. Don't worry, there is nothing about the privacy. After installation, click on bartender app and open it. In general, you can also set a start at login. If you turn on this toggle, then simply click on empty place at the bar, then it will extend all these items here. So it's up to you. If you're using a touchpad or trackpad, then you can switch on this option as well. And here you can set the delay before showing on hover. If you just turn on hover, I just hover my mouse, it will show me the menu items. I personally keep it here. If you turn on hover and just go there and go back then it will automatically hide by selecting automatically rehide. If you want Wi-Fi and these items below the menu bar then you can check this one as well. Make sure this toggle is turned on and here you can choose your picture. As you can see there is a picture. I can simply select my own picture or a box. If I choose a box then you see that now it's a box and I can choose bartender items here are simply more then this will be here and I keep my own picture choose an image there is an image I can simply choose and you can see now that it change into an image here you can turn on this toggle hide all menu bar items on inactive menu bar whenever it's inactive it will hide all the menu bars in the second type menu bar items here you can customize your menu bar according to your own choice for example you want this battery to appear here instead of here or here then you can simply drag this item here or make it visible anywhere this can be changed here in the preset section just go to preset and go to setting here you can drag all these items for example i want this one to be here then i can bring it here for example this is my onedrive item and i want to bring it here then i can simply drag and if you don't like you can simply go to plus icon create your own custom menu items for example i want to drag this one at this place then simply drag this one and it will be there and then you can apply this setting to new custom menu bar menu bar items you can also go for new bar items and choose like that you can drag this one anywhere once i make any changes you will see that this part is also moving let's say this one is here then this move to the other place and sam is in the preset you can create some sort of presets here here you can set some of the triggers i didn't set any of them but you can check them here as well there are some triggers and you can set any trigger here and if you want to show or hide some of the items you can always go and customize some of the hotkeys for them because i have so many of the hotkeys and i don't remember all the hotkeys that's why i'm not setting any kind of hotkeys anymore but if you want you can do it here let's move back to the menu bar style here you can can see that I can simply go and change color to anything let's say I want this color and now the menu bar is in this color and that's really cool I can change it 
to any visible color if I have any colors problem. Here you can choose the roundness or round bars. If I choose round bars, you can see that there is a round bar here. And if I choose rounded separate sides, then this is a rounded separate from the menu items here. This is also really cool. Maybe you will like this one. If you extend, you see that this part is rounded separately. And if I go there, this menu item is rounded separately. Maybe it will give you a more cooler look. But I keep one bar from left to right all the way. If you want, you can just make them rounded top of the display or below display and bottom of the display like so. And here you can choose the thickness of the borders like 3. If I choose 3 then you can see that now the borders are way more thicker than normal. And if I choose 1, it's the lighter one you can choose and you can also customize the border color like that. You can choose any color you like. Now you see the bar is more stylized. If you want to know how to use alt tab instead of command tab on macOS then watch this video. If you like this video thumbs up and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.